Namo dasa bhagavado arahado sama sambuddhasa Namo dasa bhagavado arahado sama sambuddhasa Namo dasa bhagavado arahado sama sambuddhasa <coughs> Yeah. So, where are we? <laughs> Last week, ah, So <clears throat> last week we discussed about the nidhisa, okay? Nidhisa means uh, DD description or the other dhammas uh, that that arises together with the uh, arising of the Mahagusala, first Mahagusala Chitta. <clears throat> so 56 dhammas, the Buddha mentioned uh, one after another, and then uh, among the under the name of the Yivabanaka group, okay, there are nine dhammas altogether, sixty-five dhammas. So that dhamma, uh, the, among the fifties, in detail, find the Buddha. So <clears throat> study from the paragraph number two up where. Abdu Buddhazawara, yeah. Abdu Baragra number 50. Okay. Abdu Baragra number 57. <coughs> Baragra number 2 to 57. So regarding these, these dhammas, uh, regarding these paragraphs, uh, as well as in the and many more paragraphs in the following uh, uh, pages of the Dhamma Sangani. There you, uh, in order to uh, be familiar with, with the structure or the was, Pali was that contains over there, uh, the commentator explained uh, analysis, first one is analysis, okay, here. Yeah. Janjana was in a, so the words, a particular word is a, uh, analyzed in, in three ways, okay? So by means of the Janjana was in a, <coughs> last, last week we already discussed. For example, for the FASA, if you have a Bali book, Damasingani uh, Bali book, then you can have a look, FASA, uh, Pusana, Sampusana, Sampusita Dam, like that. Okay. So Pusana, Sampusana, Sampusita Dam. <coughs> this is how to go. Uh, I, I don't know in English how to go. Uh, maybe the playing the word, play uh, the same word in a different, different style. Oh, sometimes they say bam or what? Maybe Mr. Ryan, we know uh, about that pan or what? Uh, they play or the words. So they're trying to play the words. The same word in a different tone or different uh, surface or preface and so on. <clears throat> so, so that can be understood in the three ways. Number one, Yanjana was in. So the word def sometimes definition, definition of each a particular word will be uh, provided in a, another term, not the same word. Maybe root also different, stem also different, okay? Uh, and then the word itself also different. 
So like here, uh, for the gold, okay, uh, yeah, on uh, regarding the dosa and gold, so gold, gujana, gujidad. So when this word is uh, <coughs> uh, explained, so it replaced with another word, which is totally different, the stem, the root, and so on. So that is what the dosa. Kodo is it uh, defined by the word, by use of the word dosa, dosana, dosidata, for the godo, gojana, gojidata, like that. So different words. <coughs> so also here, sometimes you can see here, paso, kusana, okay? Uh, pasa, so the word is fasa. And then it, it is a defined word. And then another word that is a fusana. So fusa plus you, you change into ana. And then we have a fusana. Okay. <clears throat> so that's also a kind of a change of a word. A little bit change, but, uh, but, easy, but it's still recognizable. So we can easily recognize, oh, that is the fusa. Pasa derived from the food, the root foods, okay? Or uh, maybe they are what the alternative was for the pasa. So that is one way. Another is upasaka uh, was in by adding prefix, different prefix. So for the paso, so when the Buddha said the paso, pusana, sam pusana, so by adding prefix sam to the pusana, then we have another different, another interpretation, another definition of the same word, pasa. <clears throat> and then, uh, the, and for, for, for the, for example here also, vijara, vidago vijara or something like that. So there, that one you can find where? On the paragraph number eight of the Damasangani Bali, they are the more does mean some ye vijaro hodi, your does mean some ye jaro, vijaro, nu jaro, and so with the many different uh, prefaces. The Buddha trying to explain the word vijara. Okay, so that is uh, it, it is analyzed, analyzed. The term, the same term is analyzed in the different uh, by adding different prefaces. And also the last one is atta was in by means of the meaning. Okay. The meaning will be changed. Pusana, so the fasa means just touching. Pusana is the manner of touching. Sampusi dada, the state of being touched, or the state of touching, you can say. So that meaning will be changed. The meaning will be changed. So since the word is a change, Okay, so <clears throat> each and every was I believe that to recognize that the different function of the same uh, mentality. So paso, pusana, sampusana, sampusidada, and so on. So also for the regarding the banya, so banya in the area is where on the on the page, uh, paragraph number 16, 60 of the Dhammasangani Bali, there the Buddha explained in many different terms because Panya is uh, the, how do you say? Panya is the most part, the most important part in the, in the Buddhism. And also Panya is the goal of the Buddhism, right? You can see. <clears throat> That's why Banya plays a very important role in the Buddhist literature uh, and also in our life, in the life of the Buddhist people. So that's why Banya has many different terms, like Bandicha, Nebunya, Kosala, Vibhavya, and so on. So, <clears throat> so in this way, uh, that kind of uh, explanation, so whenever you read uh, Bali, Tamasini Bali, so there you may encounter oh, the same word, they are talking in a different uh, forms, uh, shapes, uh, meaning. 
So that you have to understand, you have to recognize. I, I, I am thinking that whether do you read the Bali itself or not. Tamasangani Bali itself. So please try to read sometimes. So trying to find delight uh, in the in reading uh, Tamasangani Bali itself. Maybe just one para, one paragraph. But uh, you have to uh, read it with a deep reflection, deep consideration. How this word is it? Maybe this word is it, uh, in the, uh, defined, provided by the Buddha, by uh, by analyzing, analyzing by means of the Ubasaka or Myanjana or Atta. <clears throat> you need to make it such an effort. So then uh, you will be able to recognize that when you are reading through all the Tamasangani tests. Okay? easily recognized. You can easily trace uh, this is a difference in terms of the Pyanjana. What is the difference? Or preface is the difference. You just need to add more attention when you are reading Tamasangani uh, Pali. Uh, so long as you are studying Buddha's teaching, uh, the Pali was uh, uh, how do you say, you are friends. Okay. Pali was you treat, you have to treat you should not be afraid of the Bali wars uh, and also Bali structures <clears throat> because it, it, you, have to, you have to treat them uh, by your friend. So only then you will be, maybe you, you will go along with the Bali and then easily recognize it's the differences and changes and then maybe slight change or maybe much change and so on. So that, <clears throat> that's why I commented I provided before going very in detail about the uh, Dhammasangani Pali. So regarding the following, regarding the structure of the following uh, definitions, so it it is a very good to have a, such a uh, 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 the information. And also the award can also be differentiated in four ways, right? Last week we talked about that also. So they can be different in terms of the name and their nama, nanada, okay? Uh, they can be different in terms of the name. Yeah. Kadamo does mean samayi biyabada hodi. So the Buddha talk about the biyabada at the time. So with the different name, the Buddha gave dusana, Sorry. So, Kodo is there, but the Dosa is replaced. So, <clears throat> that kind of difference also. Synonym there, what the synonymous word. Synonymous terms of the word I provide uh, information. <clears throat> regarding the nature of uh, that uh, mentality. So, Lekana, Nanada, because of the being different, okay, they may, be, may belong to the same group, but uh, since they have a different characteristics, that's why uh, uh, they can be counted in, under the different category. It means one, two, three, four, and so on. Something like a Kanda. Uh, Pai Kanda we have, so under, as a name of the group, as, as under the name of the Kanda, so it is only one, okay? But uh, that Kanda can be, can still be differentiated in terms of its characteristics, Lakana, because of Ruba, Rubana uh, Lakana, Ruba is Rubana Lakana, it says it has the nature of a changing, constant changing, uh, Vedana, Vedhita, Lakana, it, it, it has a characteristic of a, what? Enjoying, characteristic of enjoying, and so on. <clears throat> In this way, they become a, how do you say, they, are, they, they become a different to what's one another. And then another one is the Kichyana, another different function. They are having different function. So you can see uh, Manda for Samabhadana, Okay, I think uh, you, you still remember for Samabhadana, Ubananam, Babakanam, Bahanaya, Vayamo, right? 
uh, do 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 make an effort or what? Bahana ya do abandon the abandon effort. And also what? No banana, babagana, no badaya. That is preventing effort. So they say effort, but it, they have a different function. Sometimes abandon, try to abandon. Sometimes try to prevent. And also no banana, kusalana, obadaya, productive. Okay, productive effort. Trying to produce kusala. And then bring your power, develop. Okay, development, development effort, effort to develop more and more, or effort to cultivate more and more good. <coughs> Kusala to arise. So the same, uh, the same effort, but they have a different function. That's why we have a four kinds of samabharana. So also there may be, um, we have a different function regarding Vedana Pasa, Vedana Sanya, Sankara. Sanya, Vinyana, and so on. <coughs> then another one, the last one is Badeke Bananada, uh, destructive force, okay? Badeke Bananada. So destructive force is uh, different uh, uh, from one, one dharma to another, okay? Uh, sometimes because of this destructive force, destructive power, so sometimes because of another destructive power, maybe the same thing it may happen. So last week we we end up with this one uh, for asa dhamma. Okay, asa dhamma means ignore dhamma, ignore, not ignore no bad dhamma, but ignore bad dhamma. Uh, how does the wicked? So someone become a wicked, someone become an evil person. Why? <clears throat> because of the anger, because anger is the dominant in his mind, in her mind. So with the anger, Kodo Atana Jana Di, the Buddha said. So if you are influenced by the anger, you will not be able to differentiate whether it is beneficial or not. Kodo Atana Jana Di, Kodo Dhamma Nabasati. So like that, the Buddha said. And also Mecca, Mecca means smear. You're trying to smear others' goodness. Uh, <clears throat> so that's also a very bad thing. So we have to accept if someone is a good, as a good one. If it is a bad, we have to accept as it is a bad. We, sh we should not smear uh, here. Once the goodness with a tiny of a badness. So we have to uh, keep, it. Uh, we have to look at it from the different perspective. So we should not apply the same idea on the, all the time. <coughs> so that is uh, very important. And so sometimes they say uh, a, a person become a good. Now, now he is a very, he or she is a very good. Very getting very clever, very very obedient, and also very dutiful or responsible person. Maybe formerly he or she was a not a good person. Maybe a thief. She has a stolen. Uh, she, uh, she stole, steal, stole another's property one time, once in life. But uh, maybe after that, she became very good. Now also she is very he or she is very good, but. If some no time, some people they want to understand, uh, complain, or they don't want to praise the goodness of uh, the current condition. That's why what 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 do they take is uh, the the very bad things or the previous uh, previous. Okay, so that they call smearing. the mind to smear with the evil things or bad things that that will not uh, be productive for the kusala dhamma, nova dhamma. So ignore dhamma will be more and more. Another one is the lava because of the gain, uh, because of the honor, sakara. Okay? Because, so if we are, uh, if we are craving for the gain, 
Because we want to gain more and more. Okay. Uh, we want to be millionaires or billionaires or trillionaires and, and so on. So, for example, now the, <coughs> in Myanmar also elections are coming. Uh, in America also elections are coming, maybe November 3rd. And here in Myanmar, November 8th. So, uh, because they want to gain position, lava, that's called lava, okay? Uh, some people, they, they use it in a very righteous manner. They try to gain the, the people's consent, people's vote uh, in the righteous manner. Sometimes they, they try to get it by hook or by crook. That's uh, because of the lava. They do asadamma, right? So asadamma can be uh, uh, can be done, uh, can be uh, can, can arise because of the lava also. So so also honor sakara. So people are very uh, greedy for the honor. They want to gain honor. So because of that also, there can be asadhamma. So the same asadhamma, maybe there can be, uh, it can, can arise because of the four different reasons, okay, four different destructive forces. So, so in this way, we can understand. Uh, here regarding, and then on you are, uh, sorry, Sakrim in that on that other page, uh, Atasalini exposed it. Where are you? One eight three. Okay, here. Yeah. So this paragraph, the last paragraph over here. This proper difference is proper difference. You already know that. Nama nana da kitchen. Lakana nanada kicha nanada badeki ba nanada this four four are uh, differences. Okay. So there you may encounter throughout the Damasangani Bali test. So they it they are so, so th this paragraph I uh, maybe you may read this paragraph by yourself. You I think you can read it. Uh, here I make a summary for this paragraph. Uh, for you to understand easily. Among these four, four differences, the first three, four differences are applicable, okay? Are applicable in five, four contact group, Pasa, Panjamaka group, okay? For example, Pasa, Vedana, Sanya, Jirana, Jeda, this five. Because they are group of the five, like a Panja, Panja Vagiya, okay? Like a Panja Vagiya, they are group of five. That's why we call Pasa, Panjamaka. <coughs> So uh, the uh, translator uh, mentioned use this term, five-four contact group, okay? So among these four differences, the first three, four difference, like a nama nanada, like a nanada, and keja nanada, the three diff, uh, can be applied in the FASA group, FASA Banjamaka group. How do they apply here, I put it. So the name is different, right? This is very clear. Uh, needless to say, and then Pasa, Wena, Sanya, Jena, Jeda, they are, the, they are different in terms of the name. Uh, different in terms of the Lekana, Lekana, Nanada here. So for, for the Pasa, we have a Pusana, Lekana. Wedana is a Wediida, Lekana. Pusana means touching, characteristics, enjoying, and then Sanjana, recognizing, and then jedi jedi jida encouraging and then we janana knowing so, okay they are, they have a different characteristics so because of this they are having different characteristics that's why they are also uh, said to be differences so also the regarding the function kecha okay kecha also if they have a different function even though they belong to one group pasa banjamaka group they have a different function Pusana Geja, Anubona means just enjoy with Yida. Another word for the with Yida. Sanjana Geja, Fanshin. Okay, recognizing Fanshin. Jedi Yida Geja, encouraging. Okay, Fanshin. And also Vijanana, knowing Fanshin. 
So these are in this way we these three differences that can be applied in the purple. How do they purple pasa group? However, difference by opposition. This means badekeba. Okay, badekeba is a not applicable in the five contact group. Okay, the five in the five contact they have a, no special thing to do to, to, to be opposed. Okay, to be opposed. So, but it can be. Uh, how can we know if we if we have uh, such a uh, difference in terms of the opposition, uh, in terms of the destructive force, then we can we can have a, we can luckily have aloba adosa amoha, right? So, in the case of aloba adosa amoha, so opposite to aloba is loba, opposite to adosa is adosa, opposite to amoha is amoha, and so on. So, in this way, also we can understand, okay. Uh, so that throughout this uh, Dhamma Singhani, so if you find uh, differences, then you have to remember this. Okay, you have to remember this. Uh, so there can be such a differences. Or because sometimes you find a difference, oh, this difference is because of the name different, because of the characteristic different, because of the function different, because of the opposite, opposite Dhamma is a different. So that way, yeah, that kind of a concept or uh, analysis, you should have it in mind. Okay. And then the last one, the last category, categorization is that a word can also be shown with another word in two ways. Okay. Uh, Okay, sometimes the same word, you see uh, two times, three times, many times, okay, repeat the same word. For example, naga, naga, or for example, if you sometimes, if you encounter with a word, snake, have you encountered with a snake in your life? Uh, you pass by and a snake ran through, then whatever, you feel uh, very nervous and exclaim, make an exclamation mark indigestion huh? so snake snake something like it. no no one time you repeat it for two or three times a fire fire sometimes a fire broke out you are shouting because of the you are uh, so because you are so excited with this condition so also here uh, in the pali so if you sometimes you may see Oh, the Buddha take a lot of time by explaining uh, the word pasa, paso, pusana, sampusana, sampusidata, something like that. Okay, uh, maybe four or was five was maybe sometimes ten was and so on. So then, comment I explain that. Uh, maybe I, I will go to another another slide. Go back to the translation. So. Yeah, so there is a different two for explanation. Explanation number one is embellishment. Em embellishment of the term, embellishment of the term. So this is called, term is a bada. Uh, embellishment is a god, 2D, bada 2D. 2D in, uh, in, uh, in our understanding, I, I don't know, em embellishment is what? Uh, embe 2D means a praising, okay, to praise, okay, to praise someone, that's a call, maybe to beautify. Uh, to praise or to beautify, that's to beautify the word. So embellishment, embellishment also is okay. Uh, strengthening or intensify, intensification. So another word is called Dali Gamma, right? Dali Gamma. So we, because they try to say two times, three times, and so on, because of why? Because of, they just want to beautify the time. Uh, 
or they just want to strengthen, the Buddha just want to strengthen the meaning of the, uh, the Dhamma or intensify, okay, trying to intensify. So yeah, okay, this paragraph, maybe this is plain in many, uh, in many, how to say, or many lines. Okay, up to this. Okay, up to this. The, the whole paragraph is, uh, is uh, explained with this. So here I just use it uh, for you, uh, very short. Tanli gamma here, but that too deep. But that too deep is a word. In order to make it clear the meaning of the word with another word. Okay. Yeah, Gome Muladiga is playing that. Padatasa Padandarina Viva Wanam Padatu D. Viva Wana means explanation. Okay. Viva Wana is or making clear. So maybe the word is one word the Buddha gave, maybe you may not be clear enough for that. But uh, with the uh, with the bro by bro by the another word you you come to realize, so that's that's a commented uh, uh, muladiga com muladiga explained that badatasa badhandara badatasa or the meaning of the word okay badata asa badata asa sa me of the meaning of the word badhandarina with another word we bow on them explanation okay. What for what explanation? <laughs> is a go what but that too deep. Mm. Then another word is a go, maybe pass or pusana, okay. Uh, if you read the pasa, pass or pusana, some pusana, some pusidata. So following word is explanation for the previous word, okay? So in this way, uh but that too deep, we can understand there. Uh, another one is a Danli Gamma to confirm, to strengthen the meaning of a word by means of another word, or by adding another prefix, or by adding the meaning. Okay, Danli Gamma. So that uh, that why also you can see uh, in many places, for example, regarding the Vedana Sanya. Okay, many places. Throughout the Damasangani Pali test, you may find many uh, seemingly re repetitions. Actually, they are not just a mere repetition. So as you know that the Buddha never make an effort uh, without any reason, right? So even in uttering a word or speech or a, a particle uh, in the glinable <coughs> the particle, he, there is a meaning. Okay, uh, without meaning, the Buddha never said. So that's why they, whenever throughout the Bali test, uh, maybe canonical Bali, then you satam sabhyanjanam. Okay, when the Buddha, uh, when they talk, uh, express uh, the Dhamma that taught by the Buddha. Okay, your Dhamma this is the so. Satan, Sabyanjanam, okay, this is the, the very, very uh, stereotype was. The word that repeated uh, again, repeatedly appear again and again throughout the Pali literature. Your Satan, your Dhamman, they say the Satan, Sabyanjanam, right? Satan with the meaningful words, Sabyanjanam, so perfect with the perfect grammar, perfect, how do you say? Uh, formation of the words, not the not the not with the broken words. <laughs> so, so that's why some some of the scholar they translated it. Satan is a uh, the dhamma, which is uh, with the puppet in letter and spirit, spirit in letter. Satan is a with the spirit. Sabhyanjana is a with the letter. Leda also perfect, meaning is a spirit, spirit also perfect. So that's why uh, the, the, the way it, 
the point is, uh, we have to recommend it help us to understand. So with this classifications or clarifications, uh, common data help us to understand uh, the, the definition, different definition of the Buddha's word. And also in order to make us easy uh, in reading uh, the Dhammasangani Pali test, okay? So before we go to the, the 56 Dhammas in the day or throughout the books, uh, throughout the book of the Dhammasangani, we better keep in mind these uh, differences, okay? Uh, there are three kinds of the differences. Number one is analysis in three ways, and number three difference in four ways, and also the words are maybe repeatedly mentioned with the two, one or two purposes, as a Bratudi or Dali Gamma. Okay, so I will not go much in detail about the uh, paragraphs on the Atasalini. Uh, maybe you may read by yourself. So uh, after that, we go to the here, contact, okay, contact. Contact is uh, on that occasion means, your does mean some fast or hardy, that's it. On the occasion when the fast consciousness experience in the realm of this. So when the first Marcus Lajeda arise, they arise, what? Contest, contact. So what is this contact? This is the elucidation, okay? With this paragraph comment, I want to see how to translate the introduction uh, question was, okay? It, uh, in the Pali, there you will see what the Kadamo does mean Samaye Paso Hodi. Okay, it, it begins with a question. So when you encounter this, so you encounter throughout the Abhidhamma, I'm not saying any. Kadamo does mean Samaye Paso Hodi. Whenever you see, you have to translate like this here, like in this paragraph here, give me. <clears throat> okay, in Yema in, in our Damajiriya, Damajiriya uh, teach him method, uh, we say what? So, by adding any Yema Wajya, okay? Uh, please translate, for example, the, the question they will ask, your doesn't make, more doesn't make some ye pass or hoti, other day. The uh, the word is giving get the more does me some me pass or hardy. Then the question I ask, okay, please translate it by adding any yama wajja, any yama sentence, okay? Any yama means indefinite, okay? Your in that case we have to add the word. Any yama sentence we have to add before we trans start to translate the get the more does me some me pass or hardy. Then what we have to add is that previously we say what? Yes, I mean, some of you come out of your own, go to learn, check that open and all these, some of the saga and yana, some beauty and so on. The word, uh, the word that has been mentioned on the page number one or paragraph number one should be repeated again there. Okay. This is go what by adding any amount sentence, we translate the question. So commented are trying to explain this. Every, throughout the, this test, uh, you have to uh, translate like that, okay? Uh, on that occasion, when the person may die, okay? This is the elucidation of the exposition of a contest. We shall now elucidate only what is the special, okay? So, so the same thing, we can apply the whole uh, book. And then uh, from study, the special was where we uh, explain, and the rest is to be understood in the same manner as that was as uh, okay as what has been said with reference to the content. Okay, so please try to try yourself. Okay, try yourself what. Try yourself uh, whether you can you add uh, any sentence 
uh, do do the do the water pass off. Do the water get the more that's mean some ye pass off hardy. Okay. Yes, I mean some ye but a manga mawajana, magusalam, jada, obajadi. Okay. Like that. That's a main summary, a yam pass or nama hodi. Okay. Uh, like that, you have to add it. So, and if you read the Massing in the Atagata, on the paragraph, page number 183, there, uh, maybe that paragraph, the comment that I gave you, uh, the way to explain that. Okay. The way to add anima sentence, okay? Anima, by adding anima sentence, be trying to translate. You, maybe you may try uh, in your notebook, okay? Uh, maybe, maybe later you are very clever. And uh, so that's Bali flow. Maybe in English flow, we may, know, if we follow the English translation, uh, English flow is uh, different. So we, you may not need. So Bali flow is like that. Uh, maybe Aniyama is a breeze. Uh, uh, the is a breeze seeded. Uh, Aniyama was fast. And even if Aniyama is omitted, indefinite sending is omitted, then we have to review in uh, interpret. Okay, that's uh, the way Bali flow goes. So also another one. Now we go to where number three. Uh, before we go to number three, I would like to uh, last last week and then we we talk about the uh, pass or fusana some fusana I think right. So there is a bhava bada okay. Uh, I think the pasa the Buddha is playing. Your Gadamo does the main summary pass all hoddy. Then after that, the Buddha said, Your does the main summary pass all. So in that case, uh, in that, Passas are Sabawa di Banado, Sabawa di Badanama. So the dance of our Bada. And then last week I explained uh, in the day there. Okay, here, what is Sabawa Bada? Okay, so in the Mula Diga and the Anu Diga. So Anu Diga's explanation is uh, given in the translation book, Neji Wa Bawa We Bawa Do. Okay, so that one, Sabawa Bada, where be here, because we are talking about the abstract dams, Abhidhamma dams, uh, in the Abhidhamma, in the Dhammasangani. So there you will find again and again, so this is Sabawabada explanation. So bear in mind this point, uh, what is Sabawabada? Okay, what is Sabawabada? So whenever you encounter with the, uh, the community, oh, uh, this is Sabawabada, Sabawabada, or Sabawabadina Divida. So then you have to understand what is Sabawabada. So Mia characteristic of the same word, okay? Mia characteristic of the word. Not 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 defining by the opposite or special value or and so on, special moment, without emphasizing emphasizing on the another fact. Just emphasize on the nature of the same word. That's the cause of our brother. So if we understand uh Pasa. Uh, and also if this and also and also if you understand how to translate uh, by adding any sentence okay for example by adding any sentence me what your does mean some of you but I'm a mark I'm out here I go to lunch it down over now or the that's the main some of you pass off or the okay that's the main some of you push on our body that's the main summary is samples and our hoardy, samples it that and hoardy like that. You have to uh, extend, be able to extend in order to make you understand more. 
So the, the weather now also will be easy, okay? Uh, on the, paragraph, paragraph number three, we go to uh, weather now, okay? So here in this case, I will, I like you to read, uh, what? Bali, I'm singing in Bali. Paragraph number three. Yeah, I will read for you. Kadama does mean Samaye Vedana Hodi. I think you are very familiar with the Bali was as a IDBM student. Uh, you study Bali. You need you have to study, you should study Bali, right? So there are when you study Bali in the Bali language, we have a gender, right? Gender. So masculine gender and feminine gender, neuter gender, like that. Uh, here, the boy I like to ask you is, what is the gender of the Vedana? Vedana Bali what? Uh, uh, anyone? Feminine gender, Seano. Feminine gender, right, correct. So that's why, in the, so in order to be aligned with the, uh, the agenda or the Vedana, the question what is it that? Kadama, right? Kadama, that's main Samayi Vedana Hodi. Kadama and Vedana, feminine gender, okay? So question, Sabanama follows uh, the, the Nama, the gender or the Nama. <coughs> so, but uh, the point is uh, here, uh, Yan, it, it is followed by the word yan, okay? Yan sabanamabara, indefinite, yes. Uh, indefinite sabanamabara, yeah, okay? It should be kept or expressed with the feminine gender, yeah, okay? But here the Buddha may say yan, what happened, okay? Yeah, that's me. Kadama does mean some ye, Vedana Hodi. Yan does mean some ye. What happened? So, for the answer, don't, don't, don't be headache. Don't get headache. Uh, comment data is play on the, uh, on the, you can have a look on the commentary, page number, Atagata, page number 183. Okay. Uh, where it is, attack at the uh, translation. Uh, yeah, this content is uh, on that occasion means on, uh, not this one, okay, here. In the reply that which occasion, okay, let me read. Oh, here. Ah. Uh, it's easy to run away. Okay, in the reply, okay. Yeah, and that's the main, yeah. In the reply here means, the question is, Kadama, that's the main, Samayi, Vedana, Hodi, that's the question. So reply is that, Yan that's the main, Samayi, Daja, Mano, Vinyana, Dadu, Sambasaja. Okay, that is reply, answer. So in the reply, that wish on that occasion is, okay. Here yeah, you can see where. Uh, uh, uh. No, here. So, paragraph number three. So, it indicates that here. Paragraph number three. You, can, you may have a look. What happened? A new da agenda yen. Okay. A new da agenda yen. That which is used. Why? Why? If you want to be in line with the widow and the question, the word that be in the question or the main topic in this contest, we have to keep it with a feminine gender, like a yeah, okay, as yeah. But here, the Buddha use yen, why? That which is used through the influence of the new da word, sada, okay? Through the influence of the new da word, sada. So in the following, 
reply, you can see Yan does mean some me that jam and all when Yana dad do some passa jam. You da jenna. Did the sea gun, sadam, okay? Did the sea gun, sukan, all the time. So, re, so because of the influence of the word, the word sadam, sada happiness. Because you see here in this. In this context, as Marcus Lajeda arrived together with the uh, Vedana, that Vedana is uh, not the Dukkha Vedana, not the Upeka Vedana, but the pleasant uh, feeling that the Somnasa, Sukha Vedana, Sada, happiness. Because of this influence, uh, influence of the word Sada, so the word Yang is used. Okay. I'll read in the question. Uh, the feminine gender, Kadama, okay, Kadama is uh, what they use, what, they, what Kadama on that occasion is a feeling, okay, in, in line with the, uh, without, without following, without being in line with the, the feminine gender, the what, the what, uh, Vedana, which is with the feminine gender, okay, then this explanation, so sometimes if you read, uh, uh, but uh, this is whether or not it's a feminine gender. Why? The Buddha mentioned with the new da word yen. So feminine da is in that case trying to explain for you. Okay, that is the, that is the point. So in the following word here is explanation of the tajja mano vinyana da do sampasajan. Okay. Uh, in the tajja mano vinyana da do sampasajan. The word Dajja is explained, okay, in many ways, in many ways, in three ways. Dajja, Wojedi, Dasa, Sada, Sukhasa, Anojavika, Saroba. Okay. Dasa, Anojavika, Dajja. Okay. In that case, the word Dajja is, uh, you, can, you can follow here. Uh, yeah. In one of the content, okay? Sampasa, one of the content. With the appropriate element of the mind consciousness. Mano vinyana dadu. So appropriate here means Dajja, okay? The word. Appropriate conscious, appropriate element of the mind consciousness. Here, appropriate means a suitable or fit for the pleasantness or pleasure. So, for the word taja, appropriate means a suitable. So, Yataha dajans tasaro bangata mandidi. Okay, up to this point. For the word Dajja, appropriate means suitable. As the Buddha has said, his speech was appropriate and suitable to it. This is a reference, okay? Reference of the Buddha, quotation of the Buddha, what? Maybe Agama, with the, with the reference, uh, powerful reference to the Buddha. He tried to confirm his uh, commentator, one tried to confirm his statement. That his name is a what? Taja means appropriate. Appropriate means a suitable or fit for the blessedness. Okay. So then in that case, he, he trying to explain. Please don't think that the Taja is a uh, maybe a, you may think that the Taja is a ta plus a ja. Okay. Tasa, ta plus ja. Ja means a bone like a kamaja. Kamaja. Kama bon, okay? So that, that ja means this bone, the bone of this, something like that. You may try to analyze the words. But here, commented, I want to say, that ja as a whole, that ja, you don't divide anything. Uh, you don't make any division or any analysis. Don't try to divide. But you keep it as a whole, okay? You keep Dajja as a Dajja, and then the meaning is a, what? Sudeva. Okay. Anojaviga. It is in the sense of Anojaviga. 
Taja means Anojawiga. So this is a kind of a indeclinable what? Okay, indeclinable what? Row leaves. Sada, Taja is an indeclinable what? The whole. And also indeclinable means you don't need to define, you don't need to decline. Make a declination, no need. Okay, that's one, one way of explanation. And also he want to confirm his statement. That's why the Buddha, uh, he trying to quote the Buddha's word. He, uh, as the Buddha has said, his speech was appropriate and suitable to it. So there in that Bali test, you can have a, you can read in the underneath where, number three. Number three is where is it? Ah, yeah. Majima Nigaya, volume three, page number one. This is a BDS in the BDS page number, right? And not our, not Chatha Sangha edition. That's why also you have to know. Okay. So he tried to confirm uh, his statement with the Buddha's word. So in that context, the Buddha used the Daja as appropriate. And also it is in the Glineva word. Wrongly, wrongly said that. So, and then that is a one way of explanation to the word sada. So, and then another, another word. And the mind consciousness is said to be appropriate in that it has been produced by invisible object, etc., which render service to the pleasure. So, in that case, what? So, So what an dehi wadu badi adamanehi pachiyehi jada. So in the another with the word end, so that's why in the writing uh, each word, single word is meaningful. So without this, we may not uh, we may uh, if we omit this word end, we think we are going to uh how to say. Uh, do the another topic, but uh, with this end, this is single name. So, explanation for the word Taja is not yet finished. Okay, it shows that explanation for the word Taja stay, to be continued. So, here previously I explained, commentator said, I explained Taja as a wrongly Sada in the sense of Anoche Wika, Sudeva. But here, in the following, another way, there is another explanation. So, appropriate uh, Taja in this, in this explanation, the word Taja is not no longer wrongly Sada. Okay, no longer in decline never what, but it is a kind of a what? Uh, a kind of a samasa, okay? Taja, even two words, only two, two syllables, two alphabet, ta and ja, but it is a what? Samasa, ta plus ja, okay? Uh, samasa what? Ta is a dehi, ja, ja is a jada, dehi, jada, daja. Jada means produced by what? By produced by this here. Dehi bajayehi. Okay, by the many causes. Dehi bajayehi jada tibi daja. Okay. The word daja is not a not a wrongly sada in the glide never body, but a samasabada. Okay, I think you start, you are very clever in the samasa, right? In the uh, samasa, how many samasa do we have? <laughs> huh? Mr. Roy, how many samasa do we have? Six. Yeah, six, Sanjana. Yeah. <laughs> so here, if we say dehi jada daja, how, what, what, kind, what types of samasa is it? Uh, is dehi Sanjana. Uh, I think it's tapuisa. It's tapuisa, right? It's the heat. It's tapuisa. I think. 
Yes. Yeah. Which which sabu taburiza taburiza. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, bye. So it's the tadiya taburiza. Ah, uh, tadiya. Yeah. Tadiya or banjami. Bye bye. Okay. So it's uh mm. it's instrumental. So you know so it's instrumental. Yeah. 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 So it's so tadiya taburiza yeah. sama sabda. Okay. The community that is playing like that. Okay. So maybe if you read the translation itself, but you may not get that, that meaning, right? Uh, his speech was appropriated to devote that therapy. And then the mind consciousness is said to be appropriate in that it has been produced by, okay? Here yeah, by also there, by invisible objects. Mm -hmm. uh, so produced by, so jada is a produce, Dehi is a by by these pachaya, by these conditions. Okay, so please pay attention to this word. Produce by. Okay, so that means what? Taja. Okay, ta is a definite article. Uh, ta. This refers to the causes and conditions. Uh, here, something like a visible object or light, it should be there, and also attention should be there, something like that. Mm. So because of these, uh, these bajayas, it is produced. Okay, produce what? Produce a fasa. And then, that fasa, and then what happened? Uh, uh, we're caused to, we give a condition to rise away and a pleasant feeling. So the point here, commented I want to say is in the first part, Taja is a wrongly sada, okay, indeclinable word. The meaning, collective meaning, uh, the meaning of the word itself is a word, appropriate or suitable or fit. Then another word, another way of explanation, according to the following word, Tehi Jada Taja, it should be done by Tadiya uh, Taburisa Samasa compound. Okay, that the double is a compound, and then it becomes you come to realize that Daja is a double uh, Samasabada. Okay, so this explanation is given here. So Daja, Dehija, Daja, and then Manovinyana me wa Nisa Dathina. So or trying to, maybe comment it out, trying to disjoint all the parts of the word, and then uh, trying to explain what after another, okay? One word after another. So manovinyana dhatu is that, manovinyana is, uh, how do you say, my element, my consciousness. <laughs> Here, how to translate that? My consciousness, Okay, is an element in the sense of a being free from the entity. So mano vinyana my consciousness is uh, is a kind of element because it divides of uh, any soul or any creator or whatever entity. So that is just dhamma, dadu. So adano sabawan dare didi dadu. So it it. Uh, something which should bring about its own nature. So that is mind consciousness. Mind consciousness element, mano vinyana dadu. And then sampasa do jadam. Okay, jada arise, produce. Why? From what? From the from the fasa. Okay. From the fasa. And then uh, 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 we have a word, Manovinyana Dadu Sampasa Jam, Sampasa in Ja, to joy, Sampasa in Ja. Here, Komenita is playing what a Sampasa Do Ja Dam, Sampasa Jam, and also Sampasi Wa Ja Dam, Sampasa Jam. So, Sampasa Do Ja Dam, if, if we make a compound, the same compound. Taburisa compound, but Sampasa do jadam, uh, how to say, one of a content, okay, one of a content. So that is a, 
and uh, one wagaino taburisa one of the content sabasa to because of okay because of uh, content content within a uh, rice okay because of content uh, uh, within a uh, rice that they go sabasa cha so in that case uh, what happened because of is a bunch of meat, bunch of meat, chapurisa, samasa. To, to bajia, okay? Uh, when you study Nama chapter, and so there you may find what, uh, in the sense of a bunch of meat, ablative, okay? There is a to bajia. To bajia, it should be added. So here is a sampasa do jadam, sampasa jam, and also, Sampasi wajada here in contact. Ah, here. Produce from, okay. Produce from is ablative taburisa. Here it is uh, produce in contact. That is what? Satami logative, logative, logative taburisa. Sampasi wajadam, sampasa jam, something like that. So this way, in this way, Komenita is playing about the uh, Vedana. Now we are talking about the Vedana, right? So uh, with the read, by reading Komenita this way, uh, you, you are fully understanding where we strengthen, okay? And also you will be able to interpret uh, uh, the words in a different, uh, dip meaning, different meaning in the words, in the words. For example, like a Daja, Daja uh, as a uh, as a roly, uh, in the line of body, it has a what? A nojuiga and sense uh, suitable. Uh, uh, as a samasabada, uh, born of it, uh, maybe what? But produced by something, the Daja. Okay. Dadiya, uh, Dabrisa, Samasa, and so on. There you, you can understand more. You can digest your uh, Bali, Bali study also. I think uh, we don't need to explain so much uh, in the following was uh, maybe next week, next week, play, and maybe next time, maybe after the Wednesday, on Wednesday, please tell me whether do we need to go every was in the day? Because uh, in, in, in roughly, you can know that uh, up to the paragraph number 57, okay, 57 of the Bali. So all the words uh, will be, why do we explain in, in such a manner, okay? Uh, maybe grammatical explanation or the meaning explanation and also sometimes uh, maybe contextual explanations will be given there. So if you need uh, to continue this way, so we we'll go like this, but uh, uh, it's up to you, okay? Uh, so if you can, if you think uh, you can go by yourself for these paragraphs, we will jump to the another, another maybe another another chapter or maybe second second Marcus Lajeda. Okay, please try to think yourself and then tell me back. Thank you so much for your listening. Thank you so much, Sayaro. Okay. Thank, Thank you, Sayaro. Bye, Okay. Why did I do Buddha Sasana Jira? Did you 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 do Sadu Sadu Sadu? Thank you, Sarah Pia.